Hey guys, and welcome back. Be sure to check out all of our college basketball picks for today's action, including our daily free play, which for today is going to be the match between USC and UCLA over at our main website, stumpthespread.com, which is linked down in the video description. Heading into today's video play, going to be talking about this big sky matchup here between Eastern Washington and Portland State and give our lean on who we feel has the better edge against the spread we've been riding eastern washington a bit more recently they've covered for us in their recent games uh, a home win coming against north dakota by final of 95 to 71 and then in their last outing really just crushing the spread on the road for us against sacramento state winning that one by final of 74 to 54 and now this, these two teams have already played against each other in conference it was a little bit earlier on eastern washington came through at home against portland state by a final of 81 to 74 but things obviously figure to be a little bit tougher here today for the eagles as they head out on the road eastern washington this year they've been a very balanced team not really having any big strengths or weaknesses on either side of the ball they're 156th in the nation in scoring 162nd in total team defense. They have a positive plus minus on the year of about plus three points. And in terms of where they're sitting in the big sky, Eastern Washington has improved to seven and three overall. They've been working their way up the standings more recently, but still find themselves three games back of Montana, who's really been running away with things at this point, standing undefeated 10 and 0 within league play. So they're heading in to Portland State. And on the year, the Vikings. They looked tremendous back during the non-conference, but the Vikings, they haven't been able to carry that over quite to what you would have expected into conference play. This team, they've fallen back into the mid to lower tier right now of the Big Sky at 13-9 and nine overall, and they're just 3-6 and six within league play. It's really surprising, but the Vikings, they've had to deal with some injury concerns this year. When they were fully healthy, they were playing great back during the non-conference. It just hasn't been that way at least up to this point in the big sky. Now, more recently, the Vikings, they've been falling back. They've lost three straight. Uh, these games have come in defeats on the road against Weber State and then back-to-back -back home losses against Sacramento State by 10 points and then in their last outing, losing at home to Idaho by a final of 88-97. to 97. So you have Portland State heading in a negative direction right now in comparison to Eastern Washington, who's really been stepping up their play and taking it to the next level over the past couple of weeks. And also these two teams, they've already played against each other. Eastern Washington went on to win that matchup on their own home court uh, by seven points. So they know that they can beat this Portland State team. It's not going to be quite as easy on the road. We see this as being a competitive matchup, probably higher scoring. But at the end of the day, given the fact that Eastern Washington has been coming through for us, quite a bit more recently against the spread. We do feel good siding with the Eagles, getting those four points here today on the road as the better value bet. If you agree, give this video a thumbs up. If you disagree, give it a thumbs down. Check out all of our college basketball picks as well as our daily free play. And for day, today's action, that's going to be a match between USC and UCLA over at our main site, stumpthespread.com, linked down in the video description. And be sure to click that subscribe button on our YouTube channel. Thanks for stopping on in. We hope to see you guys in future videos. Bye.